always great to be a part of these smaller events and connect with the people who have supported me for so many years. I'll be available for pictures and autographs starting in a few minutes. Don't be shy. Hold on a second, can we cut the music? In the spirit of not being shy, I have something I wanna say. Growing up, I was a huge fan of yours. Facing you in the ring is actually on this list I have. So I know you don't wrestle that much anymore, but I'll always regret this moment if I didn't ask. How about you skip the autograph session and go one on one with me? right now. I don't mean this in a disrespectful way, but who are you? I don't mean this in a disrespectful way, but none of these people would be here paying you 10 bucks an autograph if it wasn't for me working my butt off this past year in Memphis. Look, I get it. You're young and hungry, and you probably think I'm the entitled Hall of Famer who just shows up to cash in on all your hard work. But it's not like that. I'm here to support you and the indie scene. I mean, I used to be you. And by the way, I still didn't get your name. You'll hear the ring announcer say it after I beat you. So you're not backing down, huh? Like I said, you're on my list. I'm sorry, everyone, but I'm gonna have to delay this autograph signing until after I win this match. I didn't expect to see Lee to wrestle here tonight, but I also didn't expect to see seven-year-old twin sons to still be living on his Sometimes life throws you some real curveballs. Slider's manager, Tex Phillips. <laughs> Did you know Tex once threw a bat at a fan who was razzing him? That was the last time his dad was ever allowed in a game. True story. Now, just a reminder, the Sliders are on the road. We'll be back for a six-game homestand next week. So come on out and support the home team or the away team. Just get your butt here and spend some money, okay? I have two 27-year-old man children to feed, and this franchise is dying quicker than the house fly. I've seen Red wrestle a few times, and she never disappoints. Unlike the new slider stew the stadium's serving up, word of advice, unless you want your next bathroom trip to end in a rundown, I suggest you avoid it. If Red can pull off the win over a WWE Hall of Famer like Lita, I guarantee she'll be getting a call up to the bigs in no time. Be sure to get your 
picture taken with Memphis Slider's mascot, Remy. And just a friendly reminder, he's not made of actual meat, so please do not attempt to bite and or lick him. Sounds crazy, but happens all the time. respect, which is something we can all relate to. This morning the twins threw donuts at me because I bought powdered jelly instead of a chocolate sprinkle. Just a reminder, they're 27 years old. Anyway, let's get back to the action. This is one heck of a bonus match we're getting here tonight, folks. It just proves you never know what you're going to see at Memphis Slider Stadium. Like that one crazy stunt where they had monkey umpires for a game? I still maintain they did a better job than the real ones. With this match against Lita, Red's getting across with the big on her list tonight. I respect that, especially since the only list I have is never-ending grocery list because apparently my almost 30-year-old twins are never going to move out of the house. But I'm not bitter about that at all. You know, it's not often we get a Hall of Famer competing here at the stadium. Although there was that one time minor league Hall of Famer Turk Spitball Sampson pitched at the age of 93. He had to be removed from the field by security on account of he escaped from his nursing home. But still, what a memorable night. some of the blows these two are absorbing, they might be headed for a 10-day stint on the injured list. To beat a Hall of Famer like Lita, Red's going to need whatever the wrestling equivalent is of a perfect game. event is brought to you by our sponsor Bobby Joe's dog board if we lose your dog the next one's on us Good match, Red.